petition for the ratification of the appointment of an acting national chairman of New Nigerian People's Party pending the election of a substantive chairman. This motion should not be mistaken to the first one for uh, ratification or the appointment of Dr. Ajuji. This one is for going forward after Ajuji stepped down from tomorrow, the national acting national chairman that will come on board pending the uh, proper election of a substantive national chairman. This motion will be moved by no other person than the chairman Bedouin State, person of group Catherine Stephen Adam. In favor of the motion for replacement of our capable hands, say yes. Yes. Those against say no. Yes, have it. Now, um, we are about to repeal. Your Excellencies, all protocols really observed. I, Legislator Nobokan, hereby move a motion for the suspension of Article 40 of New Nigeria People's Party 2022 as amended. I so move. Thank you very much, Seconda. Chairman, you always said hereby succumb the motion equally moved by Ocean State Chairman for the approval of the party logo, party flag, and slogan. I have so succumb. Thank you very much. See, all of, all of the observers. I, Chief Mandis Durimo, the Imo State Chairman of NNET, hereby second the motion every moved by the Kogi State Chairman for suspension of Article 40 of the New Nigerian People's Party 2022 as amended. So, I so second. Thank you, Chairman. I, Freddy Pomosa, and the State Chairman, NNPP, hereby second the motion every moved by Arista Ismaila. Honor State Chairman for the ratification of the appointment of National Officer in acting capacity in the following offices National Publicity Secretary, <coughs> National Vice Chairman Southeast, National Vice Chairman Southeast. I so move. Thank you very much um, for seconding the motion. Then we are going to move the Distinguished Senator. Dr. Rabiu Musa Konkoso has also graced this occasion. You are welcome, sir. His Excellency, the Executive Governor of Kano State, Alati Abba Kabir Yusuf, Engineer by Excellence, is also here with us. You are welcome, sir. The immediate past Vice Presidential Candidate to the Presidential Election of 2023, Sir Dr. Reverend Father Isaac Edahusa is also here with us. I, Group Captain Stephen Ada Richard, the Domestic Chairman of the New Nigeria People's Party, hereby move the motion for the ratification of the appointment of the Acting National Chairman pending the election of the Substantive National Chairman. I so move. NNPP motion for the ratification of the appointment of the national chairman in acting capacity pending the election of the substantive chairman. I, Ogaraya Ifemeke, Chairman Abia State, hereby second the motion. Every moved by my honorable colleague Stephen Adder for the ratification of the appointment of the acting national chairman pending the election of the substantive national chairman. I so second. Thank you. Nice. Like
like the Lega said, this is the climate of the ocean, and we are directly affected. Hi, Dr. Odeyemi Uruatosi. I ever move the motion for the approval of the party logo and the party flag. I so move as as slogans, and this will enable us. Hi, Dr. Odeyemi Uruatosi. I ever move the motion for the approval of the party logo, party flag, and the slogan to enable us win forthcoming elections. And so move. Show them the party. Now, this is the new logo, as you can see, as I just moved. This is the new logo. This will enable us to win further elections. Please, a round of applause. A round of applause. Attention. Let me say that we should all rededicate ourselves to the service of our party. There is no issue of 90 or 99% loyalty. It has to be 100% loyalty to the party. And of course to the leader of the movement or the, the party, His Excellency Senator Rabiu Musa Congress. I believe the sky is the limit of our great party. And by the grace of Allah, we continue to pray for all of us and for the nation at large. Let me conclude my remarks by thanking you against all mom for finding time to attend this very great occasion. We look forward to seeing you by tomorrow at the Convention Arena. I'm sure this wouldn't have been possible without your support and prayers. So on behalf of the good people of Kano State, I thank you so much. Let me equally say that uh, the Kano State Government and uh, my leadership have not forgotten you or your contributions. Being the only state under the leadership of the party, I want to assure you that we are all partners in progress. We will work together. We will continue to support you whichever way we can so that when together we continue to support our party and support our members wherever they are. Let me say that since we were elected, we were faced with this challenge of litigation, which took most of our time, especially eight months were wasted by those enemies of progress. Now that we are confident, we are settled, we will move forward by the grace of Allah to ensure that we continue in the provision of dividend of democracy to the people of Kano Stadium by extension, all of you and the good people of Nigeria. As we have the leadership of our great party, today we received reports from all the chairmen of the 36 states of the Federation and all the motions for adoption were received. Let me see this opportunity to thank all of you on behalf of our leader who also happened to be the leader of our growth in Kano, as well as on behalf of the good people of Kano State, and by extension members of our great party from Kano. Let me say 
appreciate all of you for your contributions, for your support, for your praise, especially during the litigation period where we went up to the Supreme Court and where we the grace of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we were affirmed as the legitimately elected governor of Ghana State. <laughs>